The potential of autonomous vehicles is, is really to transform many aspects of mobility within society. We at Strategy and see autonomous vehicle technology as truly disruptive in terms of the, the automotive industry. Autonomous vehicle technologies offers the promise of some very specific benefits. First is safety. We know that anywhere from 96 to 98% of accidents are caused by human errors. These are things that computer algorithm will not make. Most fundamentally, it reduces the cost of mobility for everyone. Mobility is in everything, and therefore it has a, a transformational impact on the overall economy. Give you an example, a traditional taxi today, if that costs you 100 for a typical trip, with an autonomous taxi of the future, that will be 25. So there's a 75% reduction in the cost of mobility. One of the big shifts is this mobility as a service, where the vast majority of autonomous vehicles will actually be owned and operated by a company as a fleet providing a service. That time that I once spent engaged in driving, I now can do other things, whether it's reading or doing work or daydreaming, whatever you want it to be. There's an economic benefit to me individually from that as well. Strategy published a report last year with the Society of Motor Manufacturers and Traders and where the benefits were, were most pronounced were really for the people that are excluded from mobility and therefore excluded from certain aspects of society. There is the reality of aging out of having a license to drive. People who don't have access to higher education because they can't travel to the places where that education might be happening and they can't afford a car. That social exclusion, if you like, can be removed by autonomous vehicles. There are, however, a couple of roadblocks to moving this forward. In today's environment, it's relatively clear who's responsible when an accident happens. Who, however, would be responsible in an autonomous vehicle world? How do we license a company to operate these fleets? What tests do they have to take? The framework required to answer those questions is not currently in place. Autonomous vehicles should be more affordable, safer, cleaner, more efficient, convenient. Autonomous vehicles would be more transformational than we can imagine today. We're probably going to be talking the early 2030s before we start seeing autonomous vehicles in personal use on the streets.